Have you ever wanted to use a lightsaber in Elden Ring? Well, you can. Kinda. This is the Executioner Sword, and I mean, just look at it. Today we're gonna be going into New Game Plus and beating every single boss in the game. Yeah. Wait, I think we're gonna have to change his character. And... That's better. Now, what's the rules? I have to kill every single boss, no matter what. All 238 of them. Wait, there's that oh many? God, bro. Now, to spice things up a bit, if I die at all in a boss fight, I can't use the same weapon I used while I fought that boss. Let's say I was fighting Radagon, and I used the lightsaber, and I died. I would have to use another weapon. You with me? Okay, good. So, first thing I did was start- New game plus, and we're gonna see if we can beat the game by just using a lightsaber. I hope you enjoyed the video. Let's get into it. So here we are at the very start. This is the setup we got. Main sword for the video at plus 10, the max it can be. Armor is simply just vibes, just for style. And dragon crest shield so we take less damage. Godfrey icon to enhance our special damage. The ideal setup for this would actually be Shard of Alexander, Wing Sword of Ignea, and Millicent's Prosterous. This takes me from around doing 2000 damage to 7000 plus damage. So we're definitely gonna need to get this later on in the video. Now the first boss of the 238, crafted Skion, Scion, Something like that. Uh, look at all that damage. And 9-9. Nine, nine. Yeah, this was a piss in the wind. Jesus. <laughs> now, time for the inedible. See you guys. Death. And we are in the grave. I actually fucking hate the tree sentinel. Here's victim 2, tree sentinel. Oh, sounds break. And goodbye to your health. And goodnight. See you, tree sentinel. And then it was time to pay a visit to Beastman and absolutely shred him to bits. now going up towards Morgoth. This fight should be piss easy to be honest. Oh, there's some good ass damage. Yeah, come here buddy. We'll just tank that. And charge that up. And 9 nine. And piss easy it was. Here I am on my way for the first remembrance boss. Open the gates. Wait, huh? if you're enjoying the video, if you could subscribe, it would help me a lot. 99% of views are not subscribed. Any support goes a long way. Thank you for watching the video in the first place. Back to it. Let's one shot this boss. Oh. We're looking good so far, no deaths. Big stagger. That. We're just gonna do that again. Mm. Oh my god, look at that damage. Oh, another stagger. And that should be game. See you, Godric. That was very fucking easy. Boom, just like that. First remembrance boss of the series. They won't all be that easy. One of the best things about this weapon is that use that charge attack. It literally takes up 30 any FP. So now we're moving on to the 40 bosses in Limgrave. First making our stop to the Weeping Peninsula. You know, that big ass island. There's a total of 10 bosses on that island, so let's fuck them up. But maybe I should not believe everything I saw. I don't know how I felt for that. Anyways, may as well stop by and say hi to you, Gil. Hey, fighting dragons in this game. Okay, let's just end this. See ya. And bye to a gale. Another boss ticked off the list. Yes, we're including Evergales because they are basically bosses as well. It's funny how this boss drops a Bloodhound Fang, which is probably one of the best weapons in the game, and you get it so early on. Oh my god, already big stagger. And bye bye. First boss we're murdering is the Burial Watchdog. And if you watched my video a few months ago, this boss pissed me off. Not even a hard boss, they're just so annoying. Well, 100,000 runes on me as well. What's in here? Oh. Okay. What the actual fuck? Not knowing what to do here, I gave the community a chance to redeem themselves. Oh, it actually worked. Okay, here we go. Why is there so many little shits? Yeah, how's that stagger going for you, buddy? Even though I was getting jumped, Watchdog went down pretty easy. Boss ticked off the list. Nice. We are now off to kill a bear that maybe had too much to eat. 
Oh man, I really want that chest. Here's the big boy himself. Oh, damn. Yeah, you can't grab me, buddy. Hey, see ya. Alright, here we go, the first Earth Tree of the video. Now you're gonna see this boss a decent bit through the series because there's 23 of just this. They're pretty easy once you know what they're gonna do. Okay, let's see what I'm to do. Damn. And that's another one down. Help! Help! Help me! Give it a rest, man. Jesus Christ. Oh. Jesus fucking Christ. That could Jenny be the fastest boss kill ever. Another catacombs? You know the drill. Pull the lever, run for your life, fight creepy ass boss. Wait, huh? that's not a part of the script. This is such a cool uh, mob in this game. We don't know anything about it. Save it. No, I have to use a stone sword key for this, just to get to this boss. Even though I've already killed him in my last series, so I'm literally getting on from this. I was just doing too much, like. And so in this clip, I was struggling hard trying to find this cave. This is another boss, really. Yeah, I don't get why they even bothered adding this boss, to be honest. stupid boss. Here's another boss ready to go down. Remember earlier when I said I hate bosses when they're on a horse? I still strongly agree with this point. Like, where are you going? Where is bro going, like? What is this boss doing? He's just running away from me. Beating that annoying ass boss made my day. Fuck those bosses with the horses. There's a lot of hidden bosses in this game, and here's one of them. Oh, secret boss. Where is he? There he is. It's an ugly ass fucking bird. Get your bitch ass out of here. See you, that bird. We are now back in Limgrave. And we're going to be fighting the 30 bosses that are in them grave. We would be here all day if I showed each fight, so here's a little compilation of the boring bosses. Um, bye bye, pumpkin head. And just see ya. And boom. Boom. Okay, that's the boring bosses over with now. Look at that beautiful view right there. My useless horse, get up this fucking cliff. Thank you. Whoa, he does not take that much damage, you know. I know all your moves now, buddy. Yeah. Boom. We. Oui. Boom. See you, Crucible Knight. That's gonna I'm die. probably gonna die to my own stupidity more than these bosses. Uh, fall damage is my worst enemy in this game. The bosses are grand. When it comes to fall damage though, that is where I die most. We're getting invaded? Okay. Oh shit. Who are you? Huh? Oh, where's the boss? I know it's gonna come. Okay. Oh, it's Patches. I didn't know you could fight Patches. Oh, that's got a little kick, doesn't it? Do you? What you gonna do if I go over there? I wouldn't kill him, but you have to. Right there. Oh, damn. What the fuck? Who the hell is this? Yeah, we just eat that. That was very quick. So I think if you go to night time on this, summon someone else. Okay, he's gone now. Now look. This cunt 
Guess what weapon he has? He has my weapon. Fuck me, he does damage. He does not stagger. This is what I would doubt the hardest boss in the grave. Walk into it. Yes! We got him. That is actually a hard fight. I've never uh, bet him before. Doesn't he go invisible? Or something? Well, that went well for him. Remember earlier when I said that I need to get some of the items? Yeah, this guy is going to be a big help. Go on, buddy. There you go. One of the best characters in this game, without a doubt. Here I was trying to find a boss location, but I just couldn't figure out where the hey, fuck what? it is. I've never been down here, I don't think. I've never been down here, I don't know what the hell to expect. Come down. I missed. Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no. What did I say? Fall damage. What the hell? Did you know this place existed? Because I know I didn't. You're not a boss. That took so long to find. This boss took me 10 minutes to find. All of that for this. Are you serious? I fought these about a million times. Damn, look at all that damage. Finally. When I first played this game, I struggled hard with this invader, but now... Yeah. Probably didn't have any flasks. How about this? Yeah, how about that, buddy? That was the fastest fucking kill. We are approaching the final boss of the video. I'm pretty sure this is most of the bosses in Limgrave. If I miss any of the bosses, let me know down in the comments. Normally they're supposed to drink a flask in the fight, but didn't even get a chance. We have now bet every single boss in Limgrave. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.